Hi there. Well, as you may or may have not noticed, I haven't been making Steelbooks reviews in quite some time. And the reason for that is I really haven't been buying Steelbooks on a regular basis at all. For me, if I'm going to get a Steelbook, the film needs to be something quite spectacular nowadays. It's got to be like one of my top favourites or a classic or, you know, a movie, a new movie that I really loved, a five star film. Uh, I'm not just going to be be buying any title just because it's a steel book, and you know Xavier have been bringing out some really good steel books, but um, I think some of the titles they've been choosing leave a lot to be desired um, for me as as what I would class good films. So uh, when I saw that they were making the Jurassic Park films into steel books, you know I I thought oh fantastic! I actually don't own Jurassic Park on Blu-ray. I just want I just wanted the 2D version as well and I like the sequels I think they're okay but uh for me the only one I really wanted to own the only one that really for me is what I would call a, a top a five star classic is the first film Jurassic Park so that's the only one I went for you can buy the sequels in steelbook as well but um yeah I just wanted the original and the best and it's a very nice steelbook it's a nice glossy front as you can see and uh, the words Jurassic Park are debossed and we've got some uh, embossing on the uh, dinosaur as well and I like the fact that the you know the front of it looks like the wooden door with the torches on the side so yeah really nice design on this I think all the steelbooks in this range are nicely designed so if you you do like the the other two check them out and see if you can pick them up there's the uh, There's the spine. The image goes all the way around, as you can see. I have to say, when I opened it up, the inside is a bit, as you can see there. So it's quite delicate, can probably easily be dented. That's the back image with the uh, Tyrannosaurus Rex in the mirror. Uh, mine had a slight chip here. That's another thing for me. Steelbooks, um, they're still coming out with slashes on spines and and other chips and damages, and it just you know, it, it's just such a, a frustrating thing when you, you you're ordering these and you want to get them 100% uh, mint. It uh, seems to be the case that you know every other one comes with some damage, which uh, can be quite frustrating. But yeah, the uh, actual steelbook overall, apart from that tiny chip, um, it's a nice steelbook and definitely one I'm glad to have in my collection. I'll show the inside artwork. Uh, not great, to be honest with you. It's a you know it's a good choice of pi you know picture, but um, you really got a you know, work hard to see what it exactly it is. I mean, it's the Tyrannosaurus Rex there. Yeah. But, you know, it's not just my camera that's not picking up the image. It just really doesn't stand out. So, that could have been better. The prices on these, £15, isn't bad. So, you know, it's quite reasonable, I suppose, if you want them to collect you know all the movies. I know. I think Xavier have already planning to bring out Jurassic World on uh, Steelbook, so you can complete uh, complete the films until they bring out the next one, of course. Okay, so you get some bonus features on here: um, Dawn of a New Era, Making Prehistory, The Next Step in Evolution, and Making the Game. And you get plus over one and a half hours of additional archive archival featurettes and behind the scenes footage. And you also get a digital HD ultraviolet, uh, which is which is pretty cool. And it's a nice addition for something that's uh, 15 quid. Um, the movie itself, English DTS HD Master Audio 7.1, French, Italian, German, Spanish, Japanese DTS Surround 5.1. Subtitles are English for the hard of hearing, French, Italian, German, Spanish, Japanese, Cantonese, Danish, Dutch, Finnish, Icelandic, Korean, Norwegian, Portuguese, Swedish, and traditional Mandarin. So quite a choice of uh, languages there, whether it be audio or subtitles. 
as I said before, the movie is a classic. Um, I never bore of it. Jurassic World's coming out. I don't know if it's going to be up up to the same standard. We'll have to wait and see. Fingers crossed. Um, I look hope it looks hopeful in in some of the trailers, and I'll definitely be giving a review of that film when I see it. I'll catch you later, guys.